and hey guys David here today's video purpose is to lighten the things a little bit better about the track misplacement so what do I mean exactly here are two three straight tracks but if the model is bad some of those can skew a little bit that's why I've prepared this E2 script that I'm going to explain to you what it does. So when I place this E2 like that, you can see that it starts measuring the distance between the left and the right rail beam. Then subtract those and if this difference is less the model is good and, and if in this this if the difference is great the model is not so good it will be misplaced so let's do the thing about Ron's rails here those rails are pretty good no misplacement and all they stuck quite nice and they are awesome so about the two if I place it right here in every iteration it will get this distance that I'm talking about, about and it will measure this misplacement in every in every delta of the guys mod length units in this direction that I'm pointing at so let's clear the console and start the thing here you can see the the yellow cube is actually the center and I am making left and right ranges to measure the misplacement of the two rail beams So if this thing finishes guys So what is the output exactly? Here you can see in every offset starting from zero the position of day two it increments the position of point zero uh, point five guys mod length units and then measures the, the thing measures the misplacement, increments again, measures the displacement and so on so so guys I'm gonna transfer the data to Excel and see you in a couple of minutes and hi guys I am back in Excel I got all the displacements about these three models in guys mod. So let's talk about the misplacements of France rails here. So this is what a good model should be like. Why am I saying this? Here you can see at the left that misplace the values of the misplacements per guys mod and unit are pretty small. Every model should be like this one here. Congratulations dude Ron. Nice rails again. Um, next thing is the PHX Metal 2048. This model is very bad. Why? See the misplacements here. 025 to 005. No matter how precise I want to place the points about this module, it should all be always be bad. So that is the main reason guys, because your models are misplaced. Some models are good, some models are bad. And this is all about the misplacements. Here is the PHX Track 16X 
This is the standard 16 length track of the PHX pack. This model is also quite good. You can see 5 to the power of 10 to negative 5. This is practically zero, as this one here. See, 6 to the power of 6 to 10 to the power of negative 5. This is a zero, practically zero. Every model sh should be as good as this one. So, I hope this video was useful for some of you who, who have questions about hey, dude, why my tracks are not snapping the way they should be. This is the main reason why this happens. And also the multiplications, adding and stuff like that. So if you get 2 multiplied by 2, this is not always 4. We, we have floats here. This 3.999999 so on. This is because the, of the representations in the the values in the computer. So have fun guys and see you next time.